Thousands of COVID-19 vaccine appointments are being rescheduled across the country and in the Carolinas tonight. The winter storm that moved through is causing some shipping delays, but many of you still have questions and our vaccine team is always working to get you answers. WBTV anchor Maureen O'Boyle joins us live in studio. Maureen, one viewer is concerned the new variants of the virus. Absolutely, Alex, and there is some brand new information just in on our very first question to the vaccine team. Do the current vaccines protect you against those new strains of COVID-19? The answer is yes. The New England Journal of Medicine just released this information late yesterday. Researchers tested variations of the virus. They found the vaccines did offer protection. They didn't produce as many antibodies, but enough to neutralize the variant of the virus. More study, of course, is needed. They say make sure to get your vaccines. Our next question came from Charles, and he always gives blood, and he had a very interesting question to the vaccine team. Will giving blood reduce COVID-19 antibodies? The answer is absolutely not. In fact, I spoke with One Blood. It's an organization that distributes blood to hospitals working to save lives of those people who are fighting COVID-19. One blood actually wants your blood and those very important antibodies. If you've had both doses of either the Moderna or the Pfizer vaccine, the FDA wants you to wait 14 days, then you can give blood. The antibodies in your donation could really save lives, and it is the same if you have recovered from the COVID illness. I'll link you to One Blood for donation opportunities, along with more on why both vaccine makers say, regardless of variants, you should still get the vaccines that are currently available. That's all online. Just go to wbtv.com slash vaccine. Alex. Maureen, thank you. Great information. Don't forget, you can send us your questions. You can submit them online or email them to vaccine team at WBTV.com. You can also look through some of the other questions we've already answered. So you can download our app or you can find us on Roku, Apple TV or Amazon Fire.